Hello, nerds of this earth, and welcome back to Elite Dangerous Sweaty Day. Uh, I'll do something. I don't know. I, I feel like this is a very repetitive sort of, you know, thing. I just, you know, I, I sort of say, hello, nerds of this earth, do a mission or a couple of missions, and then maybe do some more, and then end. And then every sort of five episodes, I, or, you know, seven or whatever, I get a new ship. Um, so I wonder what I could do to mix things around. I suppose I could go... And there's all a bit of a piratey thing, but I mean, what would be the point of doing that? Um, I could just sort of go and just try and get. To, let's try and get to work. Why the heck not? Uh, you need a pass or whatever. I'm assuming you can get those somewhere. Let's see if you can get one at Barnard's Star. So, since, of course, Galaxy Map, that's one. Let's go to Barnard's Star. Or oh, somewhere. Oh, God, we're quite far away, aren't we? Oh, there's no point in looking for it there because it'll take a while. Just search. Um, Sol, and then go to Proxima, or wherever it is. Oh, it's over there. God, this bookmarked quite a few places, haven't I? Uh, right then, so... Uh, what was that? It says Epsilon. It's a great word. Epsilon Indy. Lovely. Uh, Alpha Centauri Centauri. Barnard's... Let's go there. I think that's close. Sure. Set a course! Many places. Capricorn. Again, another great name. Uh, unless you're a villain in Doctor Who, in that case. Oh, but it's not. It's still a great name. It's just not a good. Day. Anyway, 21 jumps away. Do, uh, can I refuel or get some fuel or whatever? Because I don't know if I have any fuel or not. It might be good to get some fuel. Breathe. <laughs> right. Uh, let's see. I mean, there's not really much I can get. So I should probably make the weapons better and not different. And uh, what have I got? Burst laser and pulse laser. What else are there? Burst laser, pulse laser, burst laser, pulse laser. Um, there are two. There are no things here. Right. Um, so, uh, let's just see what I can do to outfit the ship. So, uh, are there any lock-on missiles? Seeker missiles. Green con, green con, same thing. Right. Um, so, sports multi I assume I can still use those. And then there's mines. Eh, probably not. So, let's go with... I could just, I mean, what do I have low down? I just get new cannon. Do I have the, um... Oh, what's the difference between multi-cannon and cannons? That's, like, a thing, and that's uh, a thing. Well, let's just buy this and then compare it. Although I think that was a high damage a second, but then again, it also, I could just compare the other one, couldn't I? Because that's... Anyway, because uh, I already have one. Okay, so, let's uh, just do a little compare. Cause I think it has a higher damage a second, but it doesn't actually have a higher, like, if it hits, it does, but this just constantly hits something. It's constant bombardment. So it's a fair amount less DPS, much less, well, slightly less, 2% <laughs> less, so not much less, 2% less power draw, um, much higher rate of fire, much more ammo, so we won't spend so much time reloading, much higher shot speed. Um, does that mean it's just less damage? But it might, and I think it's cheaper to refuel as well, um, or re rearm, whatever. Get that. Um, yeah, so is this not. There's a gimbaled one there. What did I have that wasn't that? Did I get that? So I was like, oh, I'll get a frag cannon that's gimbaled, but it wasn't. Did I not get. Did I get that instead? Maybe I got that instead. That does much more damage! Why does that do much more damage? Gimbaled stuff usually does much less damage. Wait. They're both E1 and. A turret stuff terrible, quite possibly. Okay, um, what are the things of turrets? That's a seeking missile. I can't compare that because it's not another one. Cannon. Uh, okay, so we've got small cannon, which is like boo, poo, uh, and then we've got multi cannon. So I mean, quite a bit less DPS, but it might be better. And yeah, sure. Let's just get. A big old bunch of multi cannon. Why not? Uh, get a bit of money as well. That's good. If I explode, I'll be able to get, uh, uh, you know, refunds more. Uh, I won't spend as much money on insurance and stuff. So that's good. And also, I'll be able to get more money from insurance. Right. Let's get two of these then. Good. That's yeah. They're good. It is it is gimbled. Always good to check because uh, if you're massively inaccurate, then. There's not really much point in not having a gimbaled weapon. Good. Got that and that, and then sort of two laserish weapons. Good. Let's exit here and go to space. And by space, I mean we're already sort of in space. I mean, technically everything's in space, unless it's outside the universe, which is still probably in some form of 
space like thing. What about outside the universe? I was thinking about this earlier, and that's for um, theoretical physicists and philosophers to think about, and for the rest of us to think, ah, yeah, sod it, it's not important, because most likely no human will ever discover it. Um, good. Let's go. Theoretically, you know, if you were going at the speed of light or whatever for a 14, or, you know, faster than the speed of light, for like, you know, seven, oh, seven billion years, you, well, not seven, but how long has the universe been alive for? Many years, to say a trillion, I mean, it's not, but it's when a stupid amount of time. What would be a 36 and I don't know. Um, a certain amount of time, so if, you know, if you go presumably speed of light in a certain direction for a certain amount of time, you'll eventually reach uh, uh, the, you know, the edge of the universe and be like, oh look! What does God need with a starship? Greatest line. Anyway, that's irrelevant. That was like the centre of the galaxy, not the centre of the universe. Um, all the outer edges of the, whatever. So, yes, let's do a thing. Uh, let's go over here, which is apparently only three places. Engage hyperdrive! I'm gonna put the landing gear away. Engage hyperdrive! Yes, Star Wars now. Good. Uh, yes, I, I will do jump cuts through all this probably, um, or I could just sort of just you know speak while I'm doing it. That might be fun. What's that? Is that the home star? I guess that's the home star. Whoa! I can bring out my weapons and shoot everyone like some form of Texan that's just found some black gold or whatever. I, I don't know. I would have this as like a mini bird trip. What the heck not? It won't take too long to jump 21 jumps. Um, but let's, let's mathematically count how long it would theoretically take. As long as, you know, you don't warp into a place and the place you need to go to is behind a star, so you have to not set a course for the system, then jump to warp speed and go around it. Big star. So, let's count. One, two, this would be very interesting commentary, but five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, I could save a bit of time from just pressing J straight away, okay, so let's just say, you know, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, very interesting commentary, 25, 26, 7, 8, 9, 10, uh, 30, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 40. It takes about 43 seconds to actually do anything between stars, to like, get between the stars. So, uh, let's just say roughly, you know, 35, because I waste a load of time not judging the FSD while doing the thing. So yes, that's good. Um, we're heading towards an independent dictatorship. South Korea, not South, North Korea be classed as an independent dictatorship. They're pretty, they're pretty independent, and they're certainly a dictatorship. Um, but would they be, I mean, they don't have any, not like, a, you know, they don't have much in the way of allies. Like, 90% of their trade comes from China, but it's China's close thing. North Korea, tough to run. I don't know. Um, <sighs> now people have the internet. Right, good, there's some stars and shiz. Good, it's massive ball of gaseous stuff, like this channel. Um, there is gonna be a reboot, and it will be terrible, but still, what the hell, we'll give it a go. -da 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 -da. I think I'll do that after this series is finished, because then, you know, clean slate, boom, stuff that's really not that much different, but whatever. I am throttling up. Aren't I, am I not? No, I'm not. Okay, cool. Go! Go from, like, a quarter of the speed of light to 7,000. That won't buckle anyone's hole. No! Not in the slightest. Fantastic. Um, yeah. That's good. I've been watching videos on the, uh, The Simpsons Hit and Run recently. Ah, oh, that was a fun game for my childhood there. Ah, uh, yes. Right, so now we need to not set a course for stuff. We only need to go 17 jumps now. We only, like, jump three systems, but we need to go 27. What? Anyway, oh, we're already going at high speed anyway. Okay, so we need to go, like, 22 jumps, but we've only gone two, and now it says 17 because of reasons. Uh, 17 jumps after Centauri. I presume you need to go to a nearby star system to say, hey, can we go to Earth? Unless you can just go to Sol or Earth or whatever anyway. I don't know, not that one, this one. Engage hyperdrive. drive, point the, no, at middle mouse, point the ship at the star. Perfect. And while we do that, I need to sneeze and open the galaxy map. Uh, true. Um, 
Going through space. I really need to stop singing. I should edit it out. Da 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 da. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Sure, let's go with it. So, boom! Black hole. Not black hole. Not black hole in the slightest, is it? It's you know, not not black and not really a hole, is it? I mean, black holes aren't really holes. They're like balls. Of, they're just stars, small or big, really. It depends on what sort of black hole it is. Um. I've had a way that small black holes will um, become, like, will sort of uh, deteriorate faster than large ones. Because large ones, they just sort of stay there for billions of years. Small ones, they're just like, ah, gone. Ma large black holes, they're just, they're just the Hawking radiation for some reason. Even though they're a larger surface area, I find it a bit odd that they have a larger surface area. Maybe the gravity keeps the rest of it, I don't know. Like, the Hawking radiation, which evaporates off a black hole because... Black, black holes evaporate stuff because yes, um, there's like oh yes we will not we, we even though it's a larger surface area we will evaporate slower, um so you know the, the sort of bit like you get in the Simpsons where it's like hey why is there a black hole in the garden eating everything that would probably just explode in well explode implode or how do black holes die just evaporate I suppose you know. It just just melt of what just evaporate. What do they evaporate into? I assume evaporation is just a sort of not necessarily you know exactly evaporation sort of. Anyway, I should stop talking about evaporating black holes and instead talk about how great black holes are as a uh, as a as an energy source in Star Trek. Um, the Romulans use them. There you go. I, I don't know how I'm stringing to get these sort of words. I'm just I'm terrible, aren't I? Okay, there we go. Um, I mean, yeah, that's good. <laughs> 14 jumps! That's, I don't think we've done three since the 17 jumps, but okay, might have done, I don't know. I think it's been two. I don't know, maybe it's not particularly fantastic with it. Hey, let's go here, then here, then here. How far can I jump? I thought it was like 20 light years. Or 19, or something like that. We can investigate when we warp in by seeing what's the further star away and roughly guesstimate from there. Or just look over here, which might be useful. Yeah, we'll have to look at that in a minute. I found it weird that, uh, like, there isn't a five. So you get one, two, and then three is the middle, and then four's over there. I, I, feel, I feel there should be a... Oh, crap. I feel there should be a fifth button, so, like, when you press three, it's the middle instead of being the thing. Yes! Good! I don't know anymore. Right, it does, does, right, it says to see here, doesn't say, and that's, yes. So, does it say how far I can go? Um, ta 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 not there, probably, not there, probably, not there, probably, not there, probably, probably not there. If I look at, oh, crap, okay. Uh, so we'll look there when we walk back in, and by there, I mean there, there, there. There we go, good, and how are you doing, Jimmy? You enjoying this? No, well. Why did it say Delancey back there? Good! John Delancey's with us, that's good. You can just get an omnipotent being to follow you around the galaxy, that's always fun. And, and, well, I mean, for the most part. Why did I just press X to stop? I don't know. Actually, no, don't, don't charge the thing so we can actually see. So, how far can we go? 15 light years, roughly. Maybe more, maybe less. Okay, and how far are we going? We are going... Six light years. I feel like we're not y using the the ship's propulsion to its full potential, but I suppose you know, this, this, you know, a star could be you know twenty light years away and then three light years away, or we could just do multiple like six light year jumps that would actually allow us to get there. Um, I mean, uh, does that make sense? It should, in theory, make sense, but it, I don't know if it does. Also, I've got like Lego Helms Deep here, and there's like this. Um, you know, bloke in uh, Helm's Deep, in the Battle of Helm's Deep, or the Battle of whatever it's actually called, because it isn't Helm's Deep, that's just the name of the. That fell on the floor. Uh, on the desk, whatever. Floor, desk, same thing. Um, let's go a bit away from the start. Uh, you know, like in the Battle of Helm's Deep, or whatever it's called, you get like the, the that like bloke who just has like the bombs and runs in with the fire and jumps in, and then the wall explodes. Well, in the Lego version, because I have Lego version, because it's probably the most expensive Lego thing I have, um, you get that guy, and he has the sort of, uh, he has that sort of torch with the fire, and the Lego fire is the same as those sort of small, uh, like flower pieces you get on hats, uh, sort of like not flowers, um, uh, the, the feathers. That's the one I was thinking. What? What is it? It's the thing. Ostriches have them. Ooh, 
Ooh, that's fantastically beautiful. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, yes, that is... Mmm, tasty. That is really nice. Bookmark the place. Bookmark the place. Galaxy map. We are bookmarking this place. It's also a binary star system as well. Let's bookmark this place. Fantastic. There's probably somewhere online you can find this. It's like all of the locations. Oh crap. All of all of the locations of places you can go to with pulsars or nebulons or nebulons. Yes, that's a thing. No, definitely definitely not just thinking of the ship in Star Wars. No, nebulas. That's one. Um, yes, yeah, so there's a big old red star there, and then another one. Uh, is that the other one? That looks like the other one. I'd say. Actually, no, I think that looks like another one. Another person. But whatever. So let's go over here before we overheat, because we're next to a bloody. Um, bar star. Why is it? Why do I thinking it's called a bar? Star? Like. Big old death star with the explosions. Um, small, spinning around, neutron or uh, pul pulsar. I think it's neutron, by the fact it's not moving. But I didn't think neutron stars have to be called things. But after searching, they might. That's a big old star. Good. <laughs> Why is the thing big and old? Well, I suppose, you know, if you're talking about stars, it kind of does make sense. They are quite big and they are quite old as well. So saying it's a big old star it kind of makes sense. Um, yeah, good. <laughs> Uh, the other really old star would be quite small, probably, because it, or, or, or black hole, although the black hole would be small anyway, because it's, you know, a black hole, but, oh yeah, Joe, um, because, like, brown dwarfs and shiz, um, <laughs> well, I suppose, before the brown dwarf happens, though, oh, sort of, I think, before the brown dwarf, I think, happens, it, stars expand hugely, and then they just become tiny again. So, yeah, I mean, the only planet safe from the, our own star's expansion would be, what, Jupiter above? I'm thinking Neptune, but I doubt the sun would get that big. So I assume Jupiter would theoretically be alright. Earth would easily get destroyed by its expansion, I don't know about Mars probably also, but, ah, milk quick. Uh, oh, we need to go around, ugh. Fine, let's go this way. Oh, yeah, I remember. You need, if you go too close to the planet, then, uh, the star, then you have to jump off warp because it's like, oh, it's getting too hot, Captain. You can't go there. It's like, oh, shut up, Scotty. You don't exist. I haven't got Jim. Kirk, that's his name. Kirk, Jim. Ah, oh, fantastic. Um, why aren't we moving? Come on. Jim, engage your impulse. I mean, oh, you're too busy in the back. Oh, okay. Uh, well, let's go over here then. What? I was. <laughs> I don't know anymore. What was that sound? I heard like a sound. Is that the sound of the star or my engines? I assume the engines. Uh, good. Yes, warning heat though. Oh, it's fine. What happens if it gets like to like 200%? Your hull starts taking damage. Do you, does like all of your consoles start exploding? And it kind of looks like they're sparking a bit. But, and all of your consoles just start exploding. It's like, blah, 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 blah. Shrapnel's going everywhere. Blah, blah. What? <laughs> I don't know anymore. Please send help. Good. How far away are we? Big old red star. Good. That. Uh, stop saying big old red star. Big old red. I mean, it, it works fine. It's big and it's red and it's a star. Uh, we are going to sneakiness. Where seven more jump stops entirely. Good. Maybe at the space station they'll be like, hey, can I go to Earth? Um. And if not, then it's probably. It's. it's, it's most likely an incredibly easy thing to is probably just like, hey, go to the it's probably like a go to the headquarters of the Federation or whatever what's, what planet is, oh, check uh, what, um, faction owns the soul uh, probably the Federation owning human style things map, power of lay um, it is uh, uh neutral box <laughs> there's no balls around it, I can't tell um, if there isn't a ball around something, I can't tell what it is. I don't know what that means, but it, it means something, probably. It means you should put everything in a bubble. There we go. Um, I, I, I honestly don't know anymore. I, I don't know why this is I'm being so weird. Solid, right. Back, and up, and go that way, and then... Yeah, I, you probably need to go to the headquarters of whatever faction we're at. Um, galaxy map, that's what we need. Right, so Sol is all about... What's the red thing. What's this? Is this the leader faction of the place? Uh, headquarters of the... Hmm, the Hudson. Yes, good to know. We can find detectives there. Um, no, this place down down, down here a bit. Yeah, that's probably the headquarters of other factions. Good, well, where's Sol? We can't go to Sol. How do we go to Sol? 
blah 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 federation blah 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 very expensive um uh probably the tourist place most rich humans will visit earth once in their lives and mars terraform 2286 i feel like mars being terraformed by 2286 is a bit of an overestimation i feel like we'd be able to do that by my lifetime, probably. I mean, you know, I mean, depends how it means terraforming, you know, trees and water being fine, maybe, m m maybe in a couple uh, hundred years, but yeah, just, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, refinery service, none. Uh, state and government democracy, star type G2V. Nice. How do we get there? Um, oh, good God. Sol cancelled. Um, what's, th oh, good God, what's this? Opposition. Oh, it's. <laughs> It's some things. Pledge allegiance. Oh, cool. Did you pledge allegiance to Earth? Do I have to pledge allegiance? Would I have to pledge allegiance to... Sure. Um. I suppose. Fortify task to... Oh, God. Do I have to do stuff? Oh, hello, pointy man. Um, all of this. All of the... I don't understand any of this. Do I have to not do stuff? Oh, dear. Wait, can I go there now? Plot course? Yes! Wait, where's that? Is that Sol? Wait, that's not Sol. Where's Sol? That's just the next place I need to go. Sol! Sol! So there's the search thing. Sol. Or, you know, Earth. Oh, can I go here now? Wait. Chat. No, not wherever this is. That Was that Naboo then? No. Go back to Sol. No, not another place with Sol in name. No, just... Oh, just... There. There you go. If that's a star, I'll be surprised. No, good. Um, Sol. Sol. Not S-O-S. S-O-L. Um, is that... Yes. Can we... Can we go here? Um... You, plot a... You know, uh, requires soul permit. Well, continue on the path. Um, wait, let's have a look at it. Can you get, like, what's this? Uh, does it say permit anyway? What's this? It's like, oh, leave power, or oh, some stuff, or oh, some fortifying total, and then triggered, and then... Oh, triggered. Um, stats. Oh, fantastic. I'm the best. Oh, look at all these stats of our empires. Oh, headquarters. Do you need to... Maybe you need to go to the headquarters or something. Um, it's good music, this. Um... Good. And Nuka Cola is not what that says, but whatever. Uh, ratings. Do like. Um, yes, this is good. <laughs> C controls 62 systems, uh, 651 explored systems, um, and a lot of stuff. Good. That sounds helpful. Let's. A lot of course. Good, let's exit out of this and continue on our path to glorious salvation or whatever. One more jump. No, 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 cancel. We want to continue on our path to uh, Wolf 359. No, uh, what the thing? Where's the thing with the soul? Uh, where, it's bookmarks. There it is. Where's the nearby star I can go to? Although you probably need to go to the planetary capital, I'd imagine. But let's go to our Centauri, see what we can do. There's 4.2 million tons of. I wonder that's crap, but it's scrap. Good, go to there for now, and it'll all be good, and we'll be, oh, breaking course. Good. We're going 200C, and it'll take 14 days to get to the next star at this rate, or we could just, you know, go there in a few minutes, like what I'm doing now. So, yes, this seems to be going very well. How many places left? Six. Okay, Christ. How do I keep talking? I don't know. I don't, I, I don't usually struggle speaking. Well, I'm not struggling speaking now. I think I've got over the stage of my in, in, you know, video thing. I mean, I've been doing this like three and a half years. I wouldn't be able to do this sort of thing, interestingly, uh, back when I started. Oh, uh, back then when the words I said made about as much cohesion, cohesion, cohesive, 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 yeah, cohesive sense. I don't know. I made more sense back in the day, but I feel like I wasn't quite as interesting. It's like, oh, hello, welcome back. Uh, well, I don't know, the, the proper intro was, Hello, and welcome to Star Wars Battlefront 2, where today I am going to do stuff, and name an episode the Death Song, and name an episode of the Half-Life 2 series Cat Catapult, from the Cat Catapult in, in uh, The Simpsons Hidden Run. Whoa, more references to that. Um, <laughs> Jay, keep forgetting about that. Hostile power? Oh, wait a minute, that's... It's better to be neutral. I just aligned with them because I thought, hey, humans, I'd like to go to Earth. That'd be fun. I mean, it's, it's like, oh, it's good if you have expensive stuff. So do I need like 15 billion energy credits together? Most likely, if anything, it'd be a million, but yes. Um, yeah, hopefully not. 
but we will investigate and we will discover and most likely learn just from like one person commenting. And <laughs> uh, to start, yes, stop fiddling around this orc okay, That sounds weird. Good, go around here and then uh, just um, go over here. And then there's two people over there. Um, please don't try and kill me. All I want to do is go through your space, even though apparently we're allied power. Yeah, screw you. Actually, I'm still within your space. Ah, oh, I dropped a thing on the floor. Still within your space. Ow, my face. Christ. Ah. Where's the, where's the thing? There it is. Good. It's fine when stuff starts crashing all around you. That's always, that's always a fun thing. Allied power. Good. Well, good to know we are now allied with a group of people who enjoy Earth and stuff. Uh, so, I assume the only other factions are human as well. Except in, like, DLC where it's like, Oh, look, I found an alien! Whoa! And there's, like, that weird, like, place and Scott Mann into the video and it's like, Oh, stuff. Um, <laughs> yes, I can do words. Shut up. It's all good. Right, Jay, let's go to this other allied planet. Um, how far away are we? Three jumps from Absentari. Fantastic. I assume that's quite well developed, considering, you know, it's quite close to Earth. Hazardous substance detected. Crap, am I being poisoned? What's happening? Where's the gas? I can't smell anything. Actually, no, I smell the smell. Ah, oh, it's just me, okay. Uh, Jim, what, what, what's, what's going on over there? Can you smell anything weird? No? Oh, okay. Wait, you can? Oh, the toast burning. I better go see to that then. Um, good. <laughs> good. Stop. Yeah. It's not it's, toast. Isn't the only thing that's burning. I like the cockpit. Apparently, is good. Shout. Okay. J to epsilon Indy. Shout. J to epsilon Indy. Allied power. High security. Well, let's not annoy the people here, or otherwise I'll be killed. Good. Yeah. Good. So. Four point three. Like, I feel like if I just like. Wait, why do you need to, like, stop at what places? Because presumably, there's no reason why you wouldn't need to just, you know, go 20 light years, wait for your FSD to cool down. Go 20 light years, wait for your FSD to cool down. FSD from... FSD, yeah. I think that's the sound I was like. You know, go, you know, like, 20 light years, and then just be there in, like, 20 days, rather than, you know, the 20 days. Absentari, whoa! It's the black word, Pox percent, it's close stuff. And that's, I wonder if, um, Lee! Wow, such an amazing name. I read that as Manchester, but it's, it's Mansfield. Um, I would go to a space station if it was called Manchester. Right, Jay! Good, um, what was I saying? It was something. Uh, yeah, I wonder if, um, if, like, like, Proxima Centauri is, like, 3.5 light years away, and a Parsec is, I think, like, 3.6, or maybe else. So, are, are they the same distance? Is is a parsec when a parsec was created? Is that the same distance between Sol or Earth, but it'd be just be Sol or the Sun or whatever you want to call a home star, um, GF three two three B or whatever, um, yeah. So is that just the distance between that and the nearby star? I don't know. Let's set a course for I don't know some space station nearby or just that. Twenty forty-five. Add a few more numbers to that, and you get twenty forty-eight. That's a fun little game. <sighs> Maths. Right. It's not only really math; it's more just doubling. Quite like I do. Quite like the that sort of thing. It's like two, four, six, eight, twelve. Not twelve. That's just that's just going up in twos. Two, four, eight, sixteen, thirty-two, sixty-four, hundred twenty-eight, two hundred fifty-six, one thousand and twenty-four, two thousand and forty-eight, and then uh, five thousand twelve, and then all these other things. Well, there won't be. Whatever. So yes, <laughs> accelerate, and I just see there's just a glow of the star just there. It's like, hello star, how are you today? Warm, I'm not surprised. It's quite warm, isn't it? Yes, you having a, having a bad day? I yeah, see that solar flare, yeah, fair enough. Ah, <sighs> what? I don't know. <laughs> good, let's go to this nav beacon and dock at the nearest space station and be like, oh my god, look at the billion pound ships you can buy. Ah. Um. Because, you know, inevitably that's going to be a thing. Or is that a star? Or is that just a person? Probably a person star. Probably a star. That looks like a star. Probably a person star. That's that's a thing I just said. Probably a person star. Yes, it's just a person star. What? I don't know. Like, those sort of people who are famous? Sure, we'll go with that. A person star. <laughs> I don't know anymore. Uh, 
Oh look, it's this. But Jay! Whoa! I'm going to the speed where I can disengage and be like, Oh look, there's some stuff. Boost! And oh look, there's people. Scan the nav beacon. Scan the- Ah! Shut! Sorry! Sorry! Somewhat. Face. Cock. I, I didn't mean to crash into you. My engines aren't too good. Didn't mean to kill you. Sorry, matey. Macy? Sure, why not? Um, good. I've classified scan. That well, I feel like I shouldn't have classified data, but sod it, it's fine. Um, stop saying sod it's fine. It's like, it's, no. Uh, good. And I've scanned a thing. What's that? Is that... That's, well, well, there wouldn't be Saturn by the fact we're not in the solar system. So, uh... Who are you? The, you're not the person I crashed into, and you have a very cool-looking ship. I want one. You are deadly. Oh, Wolf 359. 359. Wolf 359. Oh, it's Wolf... Uh, don't send the Borg. Don't tell the Borg we're there. Everything will go badly if you do. Sorry, what? Yes, yeah, so I'm just having flashbacks. Anyway, it's all good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, nothing, nothing wrong. That's in a different universe. Anyway, um, am I speaking quickly? I think I am. Yeah, what's that? Point defense out of range. That's that's fine. That's all good. Right. Uh, why is it taking so long to charge the FSD? <laughs> boost away. Come on. Why is it taking so? There we go. An arrow of range, and it's like, oh yes, boost, boost, boost. One, three, two, one. Boom. La -la -la -la. Good, well I don't really need to do much editing here, I'll still watch through the entire video because that's the sort of thing I do. But yes, we'll go to Amazon Type B, no, we'll go to the Alt, well no, we'll go to a big space station. Eden, no. Sol, Sol, how do you, how do you get there? I want to know how to get there. Uh, no, that's just more, where's a big space station? Me want a big space station. There's only small space stations there, well Sol, let's go over there. Um, and engage, don't press J, you already, Fast speeds, just need to go at faster speeds. Good. Unless there's like another star. There's other stars here, so it might just be more stuff orbiting other stuff. Uh let's have a look at the system map. Uh so this is the trying to yes, the trying to star some that's that looks quite nice. Zoom in more detail. Is there only one star? And by one star I mean one planet there. Eden, is that a colonized world? Who knows? And then there's that which also only has one world, and there's that which only has one world. Although that also has Wait, is that gas giant or no, that's just a different gas giant. Um, let me class one and class one. Apparently the same class, even though they're massively different. And that is what's that X? Hey, don't know. And then a space station there, which I'm setting a course for. I'm not, oh, is that X like my location? Who knows? Let's just go to wait. Where is there a red thing there? How far am I? Oh, three minutes. Uh, right. How was that red thing that was there? Oh, exploited by the S S Hudson. Yes. Good, all of these things. Influence 1%. Oh, so much percentages. Um, yes, this is all landfall planets. Well, oh, that you go there. Um, good, that's all fantastic, isn't it? Well, we'll just exit out this. I would have thought someone like Ephesus and Tyra would have more sort of bigger space stations than just a couple of little refinery stations or whatever they're called, but apparently not. Right, well. I feel like my uh, deceleration in space is better than my deceleration in not space. And by space, I mean FSD space and then just general not space. Warp and impulse, if you prefer. That's easier to understand. It's like, you know, if you want to slow down, you're going like, you know, 78C and then boom, you're down to 50. Yep. And then 40, 30, 20, 10, 0. So, it's like pretty fast. You can't decelerate that quickly in impulse with these engines. Okay, I got, like, some more better engines. Hmm. Anyway, so I wonder if that's a weight thing. If you have less uh, weight, you'll, like, you'll be able to slow down faster. Or maybe not, I don't know. Um, either way, we are nearly at Alden Prospect, which will be fun. And you'll be like, yes, give me some stuff or something. Uh, and then, yes, I wonder if you could get, I wonder if there's such a shipyard. Do any of these stations have shipyards? I don't know. Slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Preferably don't crash into a planet, as it, that will genuinely take longer to... You're gonna not slow down time, are you? That's that's not so much of a good slowdown speed, is it? Damn you, son! Or, oh, wait, was that like a... Oh, that's just the glowing station orbiting the... Left no fire zone... Oh, wait, <laughs> I was like, wait, I've left no fire zone? Oh, that's just that popping up since it's already been there. Alright. Uh, checkpoints, like, conflict zone, and then there's... Moon, I'd, I'd just... Yeah, that'd be that one. That's what that is. Uh, a wreckage, salvable wreckage. Oh, what's? Let's have a look at that later. Um, 
Good, well, let's uh, just go home like that. Da 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 Two, three, and J. You know. <sighs> do a barrel, 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 do a barrel, do a barrel, do a barrel, roll, do a do a do 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 three, two, one, and disengage. It's come on, and wait, why hasn't popped on me like disengage? Just, just boom, look, disengaged. Wait, am I disengaging around a different place? Am I, am I trying to disengage around a... Oh no, yeah, it's it's over there. It's just... It wasn't saying, hey, you can disengage now. That's that's a really nice gas giant. I like that. Or maybe it just thinks, if you're here, you should probably know when to disengage on this PlayStation. Just uh, take a screenshot of that. I mean, today's image for today. Uh, Law, look at the space station. Oh, it's a gas giant. Oh, fantastic. Marvelous. Full power to the engines. We will get there shortly. Don't you worry about that. No, 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 I don't know anymore. Good. Full power to the, um, impulse thrusters, the thrusters, the engines, the shields, not the shields, away from the shields. More to the engines, more to the engines and the things. It'll take a while to get here. Ah, oh, dear. Although you can just reduce general amount of seconds just by increasing. Although, but that doesn't, no, that's just like, oh, I think. So that's, I mean, how's that speed? That's. I think I'll do a bit of a jump cut. With the small help of the odd frame shift drive. No. What? Wait, where is it now? So yes, six kilometers away. That's better. Good. With a little bit of help of a frame shift drive, I am now next to the space station. Cool. Cool. Yes, cool. Let's just avoid it in case I crash into it. Contacts. You. Docking. There's a hole around. Very nice. Uh, good, docking was granted, and then we just go to, uh, oh, that's bad. Uh, good, 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 stop pressing space. And then we just barrel around here, slow down, that's where we need to dock, land the gear down, and then forward a bit, and then just sort of like forwards, and then did a little, 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 not boom. Hopefully not boom in the slightest. I'm mean, not exploding ship. There we go. Good. Boom. Landed. I am at Alden Prospect. Uh, yeah, we've got nothing that we can get here. Oh, God. We used half of our... Half of our fuel. Oh, contacts. What's this? Is this, like... That's just nothing. Um, what's this? Um, full system statistics. Population. Very specific. Good. Back to main page. Nothing. Okay. Can I, um... Or is that just like, oh, you can contact the... I don't know. Um, can you, um... What's this? That's a thing. This is a thing. That's a thing. And this is a... Yes. Good. Well, we'll just exit out of that. Um, Universal Cartographics. Can I sell some information? No. Can, um... I do anything, really. Can I speak to someone here and be like, hey! Can... If, if I, like, give you, like, a supply of, like, 50 things, can you... Like, send me to the place. Um, cool. Well, I'll do all this in the next episode. Um, and figure out how to get to Earth. Either, probably, from searching. Uh, so if you have enjoyed, then please like, subscribe, and share to you think might enjoy this video. That's a lot of... Oh, three pirates? Oh, that's not many. I was thinking there was 154 pirates, but that's just the name of their faction. Anyway. Uh, yeah, so I will uh, go legal new. Uh, so if you have enjoyed this video, then please like, subscribe, and share to whoever you think might enjoy this video. Um, Patreon, if you want to give me money. Twitter, if you want to do that. Um, yeah, so like you're like, oh, automated messages, oh, so amazing. And like the previous episode was like episode 29 was like, hey, I'm not gonna actually upload when you finish. So screw you. So I had to re-upload that, uh, which meant it was like late. So that was fun. Uh, but yeah, so thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed, and, uh, yes, goodbye, microwaves, oh, we still have those in the future, I don't even have one now, by a waste, I was thinking they sell each for that much, no, 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 okay.
Oh, three, five, nine. Should get around to going that.